What does Digital Media Wire do in the area of games business? So Digital Media Wire um, owns the LA Games Conference and the New York Games Conference, which brings together executives across games, entertainment, investment, virtual reality, uh, blockchain. Uh, how often do you hold these conferences? Um, LA Games Conference is an annual show in, in Hollywood. And you publish a newsletter or a subscription business uh, information? Ooh, I, I couldn't hear you. Do you publish uh, a newsletter or a subscription business information? Yeah. So Digital Media Wire has been publishing uh, the daily newsletter since 2000. And we reach uh, you know, tens of thousands of executives all over the world in the digital entertainment industry. Here in Los Angeles, we're here in Hollywood. You held the uh, annual uh, LA Games Conference. How was this con uh, this year's conference uh, unique or different from in the past? Yeah, well, I think I think this year. I mean, the the level of engagement and deal flow in the industry is just so high that it's been a super exciting year for the conference. We're seeing like games now no longer on the periphery, instead kind of the centerpiece for entertainment, media, and technology. And that really shows here at the conference where you have you know, the Hollywood set, you have technology companies, you have investors, you have people coming at it from immersive entertainment. I mean, it's all converging around games. What were the highlights of today's uh subjects, the, the subjects that you thought came a, across best? Yeah, well, I, you know, I think there, there were a number. Um, I think everyone was particularly interested in what's been going on with Roblox. You know, Roblox with now 90 million monthly active users, over a billion um, uh, views monthly on, 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 the, on, the, on the platform. It's really shown kind of how that sandbox approach, that user-generated content approach to creativity is really resonating with uh, young, young gamers and, 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 and folks today. What kind of companies do you have attending uh, and presenting? Attendees for this conference? Uh, presenting uh, primarily and then, and then who comes? Right, well so this is an executive summit. We have around 500 attendees uh, annually at this event. What kinds of companies are represented? I, I couldn't hear. What you. kinds of companies are represented? Oh, okay. Yeah, so, you know, the, the, the event was sponsored by Epic Games, Jam City, HP, um, a number of other uh, ma major players in the space. And, you know, it's, it's, it's your usual suspects from Act Activision to Electronic Arts, uh, Sony, Microsoft, etc. Uh, we we're, were really quite representative of the industry as a whole. What about the area of eSports? That's kind of a convergent application of, of both gameplay and television. What did you have represented here today? Well, I mean, eSports is a really exciting space. I mean, it's, it's one of these areas that you've seen a lot of growth uh, over, the, over the, the last couple of years. More brands are now going into the spa space, uh, which means more revenue. There are more teams involved. Uh, the media opportunities with influencers and streamers and casters and the Twitch platform, which is such an engaging platform, it's really exciting what's going on in that space. When will your next conference be? Um, our next show is uh, the Future of Television Summit, which we do each year in, uh, in New York City, and, and that's in October of this year. What website would people go to to learn more about what you put out and uh, attending? So for the, for the daily email newsletter, it's digitalmediawire.com. And then for our business site, it's dmwmedia.com.